Imagine a web 2.0 network comprised of three sites working as a linked system. The first part of the system is a green knowledge trust. This is a green Wikipedia with a practical focus. The war effort needs more than just facts. We need an online repository of practical knowledge. A how-to guide for ordinary people tasked with setting up functional, low-carbon societies. The Green Knowledge Trust is a place where people share high-quality knowledge on low-carbon living. It would be information central for the war on global warming. The second part of the system is an open innovation center. Imagine an online research site devoted to environmental problems that is open to input from anyone. <laughs> Organizations post problems on the site and ask for solutions. Anyone is free to submit ideas and form groups. Together, they could work up genuine concepts. As the projects take shape, they'd attract the attention of experts from about the world who'd contribute their unique skills to the projects. A swarm can be smarter than any one of us working alone. An open innovation center would enable us to tap into our collective genius. To coordinate these sites, we need a catalyst system. The catalyst system would be a social networking site designed to crystallize the global movement for change. You're familiar with MySpace and Facebook. Now imagine a social networking site designed to put you in touch with real-world projects locally, nationally, and all over the planet. There is GPS technology giving you a graphic representation of where projects are located in your region. You can zero in and find out more about the people involved. Impressed by an idea you got from the Open Innovation Center and want to try putting it to work? Use the classified feature to find grants and sponsors, then link up with like-minded people and not-for-profits campaigning for change. <laughs>